In 1996, the United Nations declared the Belize Barrier Reef Reserve System a World Heritage Site. The Belize Reef Reserve System includes seven sites. Bacalar Chico, The Blue Hole, Half Moon Key, Glover's Reef, Laughing Bird Key, The Sapodilla Keys, and the largest and most diverse, the Southwater Key Marine Reserve. The reserve has conservation, general use, and preservation zones to help manage and protect its natural wealth. This 62 square mile reserve includes numerous patch reefs, the longest reef ridge in Belize, coral sand islands, and one of the most unique coral formations in Belize, a ringed reef called a furrow. One particular furrow is the Pelican Keys, a biological hotspot unparalleled in the Caribbean. While above the surface, what appears to be regular mangrove islands dominate, under the surface is another world. In this one location, mangrove meets sea grass meets coral reef, and life explodes like nowhere else on earth. The mangrove roots are home to countless organisms of every color, shape and size. Clouds of fish, big and small, feed among the roots, creating almost a magical scene of light and movement. Nearby, Vast seagrass beds provide food and cover for schools of fish. Healthy, colorful coral thrive in this environment. The abundance of food attracts larger fish, and the larger fish live all along the coast of Belize. Places like the Pelican Keys are the birthplace of the beauty and health of our reefs. The long reef crest provides protection from the waves of the open ocean, creating a refuge for a variety of wildlife, including one of the largest colonies of frigate birds in the Caribbean. The calm waters behind the reef also provide a mecca for tourists looking to enjoy the sun, sun and beauty of a healthy marine world. Belizeans also profit from a healthy saltwater key marine reserve by harvesting the many marine products. And since 1972, the Smithsonian Institution's research station at Caribou Key has been studying the reef, creating an invaluable library of information. While Saltwater Key Marine Reserve can be considered the jewel of the Belize Barrier Reef World Heritage Site, there has been some tarnishing of its luster. Mangrove forests on a number of keys have been cleared and filled with material dredged up from the seabed. Sediments and runoff have begun to smother the very heart of our marine ecosystem. The water clouds, the corals die and the fish disappear. Natural stresses like global warming have already impacted our reefs through bleaching and disease. But the destruction doesn't have to happen. Heritage is our legacy from the past. What we live with today and what we pass on to future generations. Our cultural and natural heritage are both irreplaceable sources of life and inspiration. Places as unique and diverse as the pyramids of Egypt 
the rainforests of the Amazon and the Belize Barrier Reef make up part of our world's heritage. World Heritage Sites are for all the peoples and generations of the world. And we Belizeans are caretakers of this part of the world's natural heritage. We should take great pride in that. After 12 years in existence, the Saltwater Key Marine Reserve is finally getting regulations to prevent fishing and increase protection in the conservation zones. The new conservation zones will serve as a natural refuge for marine life, allowing populations of fish, lobster and conch to rebound and replenish areas outside the reserve. It's up to all of us to abide by the new regulations. Report suspicious or damaging activities to park rangers located on Twin Keys. This is our park and it is up to all of us to help protect it and ensure its glory abounds for future generations. Mm -hmm.